Hi guys, we are back. It is Thursday. And um, so one daughter is being done with her week and we're going to talk with her and then we will have the start of the following week from my other daughter. So what were things that were hard when you went shopping? Uh, some things... Prices changed on some of the items that I had priced out, which was hard because then it made it like where I didn't know if I had enough money for other items that I did for like a special treat for the kids or whatever. And what else was hard? Uh, so it was hard know. as far as managing meals and cooking this week. It was hard with the recipes that mom didn't have written what? down because um, I like to read the recipes and when it's not written down, it's more difficult for me to do. So like a lot of recipes I just threw together and I don't actually like have a recipe for it. So I wasn't quite sure what I had a recipe for and what I didn't have a recipe for. So I think that I assumed that I had a recipe written down for some things, but I actually would be out in the woods and I wouldn't have a recipe written down or I'd be somewhere and I wouldn't have an actual recipe written down. Um, so that was difficult. And then I just had to like talk her through or, you know, we looked up like cassava flour tortillas. I kind of just like eyeball it. And I assumed that I had a recipe somewhere that I just personally always like eyeball it. <laughs> and we had no recipe written down. So stuff like that, you know. If you were to do it differently, what do you think that you would do differently? I don't really know. Okay. Um, so what we're going to do, she's going to think about that in case she comes up with anything. But what we're going to do is we're going to show you what she has left from this week. So you can see that um, she was able to cover the meals and still, still have food left over. There was actually um, some leftovers like food leftovers as well. Um, if she wanted to, she could probably yeah. make another meal just with leftovers and some of the things that you see here. Um, but she's not going to do that because we're going to eat supper tonight and then we're going to flop over into the next person's um, week. So <clears throat> here we go. We have looks like two eggs left. Yeah, there's two eggs left. Um, There's some salad, salad. About yeah. half the thing of salad. Which about we'll have about yeah. half the thing of cane sugar. What we will do is she, we're going to have the salad to go with supper so it doesn't go rotten for next week. Um, mm. So there's the cane sugar. And there's some black seed because I did that in the smoothie. So I have quite a bit of that left over. I have a bag of rice because I ended up not doing the pork fried rice for Wednesday because we had quite a bit of leftovers of everything else I had. A little bit of oats left. A little bit of cassava flour. Should the coconut oil? Very little bit of coconut oil left. Not much. Like that was just the, the bottom. That was the main fat that we used this week or that she used this yeah. week. So some spices she, she has left over. Right. She has chocolate chips left over. I'll help you with that. <laughs> Mom ended up picking up the chocolate chips afterwards because I did have a little money left over. Oh, yeah. We um, forgot to tell you that. So the following day, that Friday, remember how at the end of the video, she had said that she might have money to buy some extra stuff. She did have money. So I bought the extra items and it came up to $20. Um, it actually oddly was $20 even. So it came up to $20 and that was part of it. It was the oats. She had dates and oats, dates, chocolate chips, and peanut butter. Yep. <clears throat> so um, 
I've lots got. of seasoning. Oh, she has uh, this much of oranges. 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 Some bananas. bananas and fish sauce, and then one apple. So, really, she has a lot that if she was starting, say she was starting a household, and this was her budget. Sorry, my voice is like half gone. Um, and she, this was her budget, she would have all these things for the following week so she could build on what she already had and use that for her following week and it helps extend her budget week after a week. Please stop. I can't. We're not eating turkey. Cookie. A cookie. I don't have a cookie. I have a banana and I have an orange. You want a banana? Would you like a banana or an orange? Okay. Okay. So that is what we did. Any thoughts? Are you glad to be done with it? Yes. <laughs> She's glad to be done with it. It actually started hunting season. She has her license. So she's like, I want to get out in the woods. With kids. Yeah. So that is what she will be doing this week. She would like an orange, please. Okay. Now we're moving on to our second person. We had fun today. We went to the grocery store and we went to a couple other stores. And yeah. So she's going to do her um, grocery haul here. And some of her grocery haul, I also allowed, I need to put an Amazon order in. So some of the stuff I um, said that if she wanted to, she could get it. Her The next two girls, they could get it off of Amazon and we'll specify what those things are. Here we go. Hi. What were you most nervous about? Um, not having enough proteins, <laughs> I guess, after I looked at my list because I was looking in the most, the Cheap okay. beans are cheap, so okay. yes, thank you for asking nicely. So I had done a lot of um, bean meals, um, so I kind of changed my plan a little bit and added some chicken in there. Here you go, baby. Um, I actually asked if she would rework it a little bit just to get some... Um, meat protein and not just bean protein and she did a really good job with it so she's going to show you what she got and then what she plans to do Alrighty, so i got um some apples two bags of apples two bags of apples three bunches of bananas two bags of onion two coconut milks um Two chickens, they were on sale, so the chicken ended up being cheaper than I had planned. So we actually didn't, weren't able to go and get the organic chicken, so we're doing the next best thing. And she was able to find it with a yellow sticker on it. And then the grass-fed beef. And the grass-fed beef. Um, almond milk, kiwa, spring mix, um, cane sugar, Sunflower kernels, these are just going to be for on salad. Um, mustard, ketchup, two things of peanut butter, two corns, no, four corns, two peas, sorry. Um, coconut oil, eggs, pasta, popcorn, chocolate chips, corn, red beans, um, split peas, and I hadn't planned on getting the 15 bean soup. I had planned on making lentil soup, but none of the stores had lentils. So I'm going to be making 15 bean soup instead with that. Um, some tomato paste, onion, garlic powder, paprika, cinnamon, black pepper, baking powder, baking soda, um, Himalayan salt. And this was one item from Amazon that just came in. Um, the gluten-free flour. So let's go over the list. So we'll go over the list and then she'll tell you what she, which stores we went to and what the total is for those stores. All right. So the first store we went to was Walmart and I got almost everything here, there, except for the coconut milks, the baking soda, and 
the onions. Onions, onions cuz they didn't have organic onions. So that was 144.23 for that one. And then the other store I where I got those other items was and I can't find it. Did you write a total on a paper? I did. Maybe over here. Yes. That was $14 there. And then at Dollar Tree, I got um, all the seasonings there for a total of $7.50 on the seasonings and then uh, for Amazon I have oh it's coming in so one second on Amazon mm -hmm. so for Amazon <clears throat> some of these are like bigger packs of things and it's items that I was going to be ordering anyway and I said that I would divide those things out into portions that are sizable portions for instance um you can buy four packs of these oats. These oats are on, um, those are six twenty eight at Walmart. And I think it was seven seventy six for two. It was seven seventy six for two of them. So they were like three, it was four, like half of the price. Yeah, it was like much. half of the price. So that was like a huge difference. So, so check out Amazon if you're looking for oats because that was actually even cheaper than like a big 25 pound bag of oats. Mm -hmm. So I have um, oats, maple syrup, coconut anus, aminos. aminos. I'm sorry. I can't even read my own writing. Rice, um, the gluten free flour, which should come in, black beans and chickpeas. Um, I'm buying from the, by the pound from her. And that totaled 58. 53 so and so then the black beans from, and yeah. the chickpeas were um both in 10 pound bags and they were like what did you say that you were just buying one um i'm buying one pound of black beans because that's okay be so it made soup. them to be like 281 per, per pound, pound for organic black beans and, organic and then the chickpeas. chickpeas were a little more they were what, at 285 okay. per pound yeah yeah so the total for that was fifty eight fifty three. So the total for Amazon was fifty eight fifty three. The total for Walmart was one forty four twenty three. One forty four twenty three. Yes. Um, and for Shopping Save it was fourteen oh five, and then Dollar Tree was seven fifty. And then also um <coughs> buying things from Mom um. One of those things is cranberry sauce, onion soup mix, Catalini dressing, um, kale, because we have kale out in our garden right now still, um, applesauce, green beans, um, tomato puree, salsa, and pork chops. And that was forty three sixty. And my total amount altogether was two forty nine twenty one for everything. Everything. Yeah. Okay. So, so she's at two forty nine twenty one. So, actually, now that she's like looking at whatever, she could have purchased more proteins or more snacks or anything like that. Now, I do go back tomorrow and I'll give her the same option. This is one reason that we're doing it for, on Thursday. Um, it, I will give her the option if she needs anything else at Walmart tomorrow that I'd be happy to pick that up for her. Um, so. What else was I going to say? So some of the oh. receipts are a little bit messy because um, I was trying to do like separate transactions because I was getting a few things as well. Um, I'll, I you guess I'll do that after. Say that <coughs> I thought, so for the red beans, me. Since, <coughs> since I was just doing it for one meal, I bought two one pound bags for two forty three dollars each. Um, and what if we were going to carry it into another week? There was a pound, an eight pound bag 
of pinto beans for those five five 43 for eight 43 pounds. for eight pounds so if i had been that would have been a better deal if i was carrying it yeah if she was carrying it from this week into from, next week yeah to buy the pinto beans it would have been a lot better um for her to do that way um our stores locally do not sell any organic beans our stores do not sell. Um, the only organic thing that we can get is the ground beef in the local stores. That's local as in driving 30 minutes instead of two hours. So you have to understand like most of the food that we're getting is trying to be organic. And, but then some days it are days like today where we thought that we were going to be going and we didn't end up going. So um, for the people that thought they were going to be going to the city did not end up going to the city and just didn't work out so you just make a second plan and you work from there so what are we eating this week um this one. so starting tomorrow we're gonna have for breakfast um potato kale <coughs> and onions um just like a hash sort of sauteed in a pan together um for lunch <laughs> pork chops yep um mashed potatoes green beans um spiced applesauce and then for supper i'll take the leftover pork from that and make pork fried rice and um also applesauce with that saturday um i plan on doing oatmeal for breakfast and then for lunch um, I'm going to be doing the 15 bean soup, um, with biscuits Sunday for breakfast. I'm going to be doing quinoa with coconut oil and maple syrup. And then lunch and supper mom's taken care of on Sundays because that's how we have it worked out because of church and everything. Monday we have, um, the potatoes, kales, and onion again, um, for lunch, rice and beans and applesauce. <coughs> For supper, pumpkin soup. Tuesday, breakfast is oatmeal. A lot of my breakfasts are oatmeal because it was cheaper. Um, lunch is cranberry chicken, rice, green beans, and I think applesauce with that too. Um, and supper will be split pea soup and biscuits. Um, Wednesday will be pancakes. And then for lunch and supper, I'm going to try a new pumpkin kiwa soup recipe. So... I'm excited about that one. Um, and then Thursday will be oatmeal for breakfast. And then for lunch, I'm going to be making a big goulash and salad. And for supper, I'll probably have the leftovers of that and any other leftovers I have in my fridge. Whatever. So that's the plan. I'm excited. I love beans. Anyway, <laughs> I do love beans, but... <clears throat> I'm glad that she did get some meat protein in there. And I'm glad that she found some good deals on that stuff. I don't know. What else did we talk about before? So I guess I will show you what I got today. Um, <clears throat> and then I'll like explain that in a separate video. Because um, I did get a few things today from the grocery store. But I also got a few things from another store that I went to. So I'll let her put those things away. Oh, I'll show you how we're separating it. Hold on. We're pretty fancy here. So they have a laundry basket in the front room. We call it the front room. I don't know why. Probably it's just in the front of the house, but it really has no purpose except for like, I don't know. It's just like an awkward space and it has a wood stove in it. And so um, they're putting all their food into all their shelf stable food into the basket. And then they're, they have the inside fridge is like their space. And then we have a fridge out in the garage, and that's, like, for the other stuff. So the inside fridge is their stuff. And the outside fridge is for anything else. <clears throat> so that is – it worked well this week. That's how we had it organized. And we'll probably continue to do that and see how she comes along with her stuff. So you all have a great afternoon. <laughs>